Well, that is not extraordinary because obviously with this being a first individual tournament for the Japanese pair. What a good rally. The oh, watch has missed that. They had been the number one seeds. Yeah, just uh, 210 points. No, it's uh, Chen and John. It's 210 points behind. But I, I'm glad you've checked that because, given my maths, as we've yeah, discovered in, in previous uh, commentaries, don't mention it. <laughs> we have long rallies. I felt in the final of the Denmark Open when they lost to Iwanaga and Nakanishi, I thought that that Japanese pair frustrated the Olympic silver medalists. And I know that Tang Ning was struggling a little bit with a back injury, if I remember yeah. correctly. Uh, but I felt they were struggling with the pace of the match. Fukushima's new Hirota, and uh, Fukushima is um, Matsumoto's new Nagahara. They, they, uh, they fit well together. Naga and um, Nakanishi, they were, they were suited better to, um, to play these long rallies. That, of course, was with Wakana Nagahara. They've had their heydays. Nagahara and Matsumoto Wilds, they walk to one. Has been... on her defense I think she's got a very good defense but tends to want to just lift yeah and what I'm going to be interested to see is how they work that within the combination two different philosophies on defense yeah and and um, it was both um, I mean, they had different roles in their previous partnerships and that's why they fit together here but they also um, when uh, the option's not there. Good play. Shoot it. Liu Shang Shu, very, very dangerous, and uh, she must be made to move before hitting, otherwise, it's really, really dangerous. I'm interested. Would you, would you recommend that the Japanese pair continue with this sort of defensive style where they're happy to just work their opponents, or would you want them to take more initiative? Um, I think I would um, want them to uh, continue, but also Short. to... Matsumoto, who has got it, then... Um, then go for the uh, the kill. You cannot become too passive. But you've got to find the right situation. It's gone long. Way long. Oh, good interception. That was going wide, wasn't it? Oh. Yeah, that's...
Standing too far back, Matsumoto. Well taken off the top of the tape by Fukushima. No attempt to attack that low serve no. at all from Fukushima. They've left it a little late for this uh, open game. Oh, the she was for Lu Sheng Shu and Tang Ning. Fukushima and Matsumoto have to find a way of dealing with this. That's a lovely dog. some sort of um, pressure in terms of trajectory and full control. disciplines uh, but uh, you were highlighting to me that in the very first round of the 32 entries into the women's doubles 23 of those 32 entries that's great pressure from those four countries yeah they, they're the dominating force in, um, in women's doubles badminton um, Chinese Taipei 
But now the, the Japanese, they're getting whitewashed here. It's way too passive again. Shima and Matsumoto have got to do something differently. That's not helping at all. So Played like this um, suggests that it's going to be really, really hard to win the big titles. Yeah. Nice block. To uh, acknowledge that player for player, the Japanese, uh, the um, the Chinese pair is just better players. So if Fukushima and Matsumoto. Who it was. Super serve again. I can't emphasize enough how important it is to start serving it when you're a doubles player. The tumble serve. The tumble serve. Brilliant.